hop in the car and I'm gonna start off from a brand new base map that way I can hone in my tuning skills and be able to get from base map to a decent like pretty good map there guys right now let's go and get the car turned on Go ahead and get the computer wired up, data logger and the emulator. Pretty much the plan for today is we're gonna start with a brand new base map and try to get it as linear as possible and get a good accurate map, not make it look like a jumble piece of junk. So we're gonna go back to map run. If anything is let it heat up a little bit and then I'm gonna load up the the OG map. Alright guys, so right now, pretty much what I've done so far is just adjusted the, the AFR and the idle. And then now I'm going to go for a drive and we're going to mess with the the rest of the map. Try to get it smoother. I know here from the base map it's a little bit choppy. So hopefully smoothen that out a little bit and get some good AFRs out here. If you guys want to see like a more in detail tuning today, literally since it is going to be a bit of driving. Um, I'm not going to do it like fully detailed. So if you guys want like a full detail on how I'm tuning, what what I'm considering, honestly guys, I am I am new to this. Everything I'm doing is literally based off like hunch and YouTube videos. So if you guys have any questions and if you guys have any suggestions, I'm the, the reason I'm doing this is to learn. So if you guys have any information you want to share. Like I won't feel roasted, I won't get butt hurt. Like I generally do want to know, so feel free to let let me know any information. That's all leaner than I want it to be, so we're gonna richen it up a little bit. <clears throat> Get a little bit to a better AFR standing, so. And yes, I'm revving it out a little bit more like an idiot, so. Damn, I thought that was misbuilt for a second. I'm revving it out a little bit just so I can get some more data. So it seems like the entire map is lean. So what I'm pretty much gonna do is I'm gonna bump everything up a bit. Give everything like 10% more. Do another five. Pretty much what I'm doing is I just bumped up the entire map a bit because it seems like the entire map all the way across is just running way leaner than I have it like than I would prefer. So I just bumped up the entire air fuel map up. percentages you're seeing is the difference between the target AFR ratio that I set the difference between that AFR ratio and what the car is running now so when you see that it's saying 15% richer or 15% leaner or whatnot then it's just it's 15% richer or leaner than the AFR I have preset that I want the car to be at so that's what I'm going based off of that's why up here you see it at 20% too lean because I had set it to, to 12 AFR to be my target which is not what I wanted I had to raise it up a little bit from the 12 from the 11 7 that it was originally but definitely want to lean that out a little bit more
that's the popcorn mod I have set up. I'm not really too big of a fan of it. Like, it sounds cool, I guess. The muffler is really restricted, so you don't really hear the pops. But I would want to do more like bang, 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 then. <laughs> Let's go ahead and change the target real quick. You see? I have it set here to 11.7. Let's bump that to. Let's do 12.5. I think 12.5 is pretty solid. I'm not too sure what what these cars eat up the best to be honest that's what I'm trying to figure out look here is showing what the AFRs or actually were and then here is the AFR differences so my idol thank you hey do what Let me tell you, I, all my cars have been faster than this car. But this car is fun as hell to drive, man. This car is really, really fun to drive. It's really slow, but it's fun, man. Like, watch. I'm going to nail it and not even catch up to the minivan. Oh, we'll caught up a little bit. changes real quick and right, guys just a tip if you guys are going to be tuning when you make changes save your changes that way you know what is doing what so if you end up having an issue randomly you know where your issue is on which map that issue began you know There's a car behind me. Uh, whatever. 